Hey you guys, so before we get started with the video, I would like to show you some scents that Dossier sent me. If you guys have been watching us for a while, you know that we love Dossier's perfumes. They are amazing and their scents smell so good and they last so long. So they have unisex, they have female and male scents. So you guys can go on their website if you would like. The link and codes will be in the description box below. I definitely recommend them. I suggest you try them out. They are definitely affordable. Any scent is $39 while designer scents range from $50 to like up to $280 in retail. So in comparison with the original perfumes, they receive excellent feedback on the similarity of the scent from all of their customers. You guys can read their reviews as well. They are always amazing because Dossier is just amazing. So why wouldn't they be? They have free returns and exchanges forever. So they never give you any hassle if you don't like the you can always get a new one or get a refund with no hassle. They also have great bulk deals on their website of up to 25% discount and free shipping for three bottles and up. So if you order three or more bottles, you get a 25% discount. And they're always adding new scents, so make sure you guys check back to their website all the time if you aren't interested in what they have available now. You may be in the future. So I'm just going to show you guys the scents that they sent us. It just says right here, iconic scents, designer quality, no markups. So they sent us the Floriental Brown Sugar and then it just tells you right here like on the card that comes in the box the notes of the scents it tells you what their scent name is and what it is inspired by and it just gives you any information that you would want to know based on the scent they also all come with like a little mini scent that you can try out so you don't have to open the bigger bottle if you decide that you would like to return it I actually use this one so that's why it's not in here but this is what they look like so they all come with one of these for you to test out. And their bottles are super cool. The lid on the top is magnetic, so it stays attached to the bottle, which is super cool because I usually use a lot of perfumes that literally the tops fall right off and I can never find them. Do you guys ever have that problem? But I never do with dossier scents because they stay attached with the magnetic feature that it has. They stay attached and you don't ever have to worry about going through what I go through with every other perfume with the Dossier scents. So this one smells really good. I like that one. And this one's inspired by YSL Monteris All Day Perfume. All Day Perfume. I don't know how to say that. So I apologize. <laughs> and then this one over here is the Floral Pear. So this one is inspired by Joe Malone English Pear and Freesia. I think that's how you say it. Cologne. And then it tells you the notes and it tells you their name for the scent. This one is definitely one of my favorites that they sent me. It smells pretty fruity and I like the fruity scents. This one is Aromatic Pineapple Aromatic. So this is inspired by YSL E Al Day Perfume. This one definitely smells amazing as well. And if you would like to know what each scent is noted with, just so you can get an idea before you buy it, you can read it on the website. And when you get it, like I said, you get this card, but you can always test it out first to see if you like it. And if not, like I said, you can send it right back with no hassles, get a refund or another scent. And this is number four. This one is the Floriental Coconut, which smells so good, you guys. I love coconut smell, so I've been using this one as well, and I've gotten so many compliments, so I definitely suggest this one. So I also got another coconut scent because I love coconut scents. This one's the Aquatic Coconut, inspired by, I'm not sure how to pronounce that name, and I don't want to butcher it, but Replica Beach Walk Day Toilet, <laughs> Towelette, and this is what that one looks like. We have the Laurentro Vanilla Black Opium All Day Perfume. So that's this one. I've also been using this one as well, and I've gotten quite a few compliments on this one too. So this is another one that I highly suggest. I think I like this one and the pear the best. I really love this one. This is a really good scent. So like I said, make sure you guys check them out in the description box below along with my code so you can get a discount and if you order three or more bottles, you will also get a 25% discount. So if you are interested in trying out quite a few scents, I would suggest ordering three and up. But thank you so much to Dossier for sending us more scents that we absolutely adore. So let's get started with today's video. Hey guys, um, I haven't filmed a video in a long time, but I'm back. And today I'm gonna be filming a haul. I have a lot of new clothes, so I'm just gonna do a haul to show you because we made shopping like vlogs. Figured you guys would probably wanna see what I got. I got stuff from Shein, 
Forever 21, H&M, Marshalls, I don't know, a bunch of places that I usually shop at. And I got like hair products and stuff too that I'm just gonna add in here because I'm gonna put you guys on. I don't even know if you can tell my face is peeling really bad because I've been out with my friends and it's summer and it's hot. And I didn't put sunburn, I mean sunscreen on my face like at all, which is my, my mistake. But yeah, I don't know if you can even tell. Probably not. But yeah, it's peeling, so if you see that, just whatever. But I think I'm gonna start out with Shein because that's, that's my favorite of all of them. Okay, so first is Shein, and I got this dress. It's like a black sundress, and it doesn't have any straps, and it's like that like rib material on the top. It's really pretty, flowy. Um, I accidentally got like an identical one, almost identical one for Forever 21. So I'm just gonna use this as like a bathing suit cover too. Cause it doesn't have straps, so. Um, next I got this top. It has like buttons down it. It's like a beige color. It's really cute. The lighting, the lighting keeps changing. Okay, next this top, I'm gonna move back because I'm like way too close. So next top is like orange and I thought it was gonna be like a coral orange, but clearly it's not. Um, it's not like an ugly orange, so I'll still wear it because it's, it's not ugly. It's just a basic plain tank top. Then next I got this t-shirt. I know you get one from like Urban Outfitters like this, but I've seen this on Shein and it's a little different, but it's so cute. So just, just an oversized t-shirt. Next are probably one of my favorite things I got are these like flowy sage pants. Like the color sage. I think my butt looked nice, so that's always a plus, but they're really cute and they're really good quality. I recommend getting them. Um, another plain tank top. I got a bunch of these plain tank tops. Just a light pink one. So then I got these shorts. They have like the, that material at the top. They're really cute. Good length. Um, then I got, I'm obsessed with these type of tank tops from Shein. So I just got a white one. And then this color, I've been obsessed with like this type of greenish blue recently. And then I just got a plain white tank top. So. Um, and then I got another pair of those flowy pants, but these ones are like a tan color. Um, then I got, I'm obsessed with the sage green color right now, and I got a tank top in this color. I have a little addiction to shopping, so the more the merrier, I guess. Then I had those same, same gray shorts, but in black, so. Yeah, that is everything I got from Shein. So now I'm gonna do Forever 21. I actually kind of got a lot from here. And my local mall doesn't have a Forever 21, so we have to go to one that's like kind of like 30 minutes away. But I think it's worth it because Forever 21 is, has always been one of my favorite stores. So I got this white tank top and it's literally like the best material ever. I have a long sleeve shirt with like, it's just plain long sleeve shirt. And it's the same material and it's so thick, but it's also like light at the same time. I don't know. Their tank tops are literally like my favorite. Um, these long shorts right now are like kind of trending and they're really cute in my opinion. So I got a gray pair and these ones aren't like baggier ones. These ones like are kind of tighter on your butt and on your waist and like a little bit bigger on the leg part. If that makes sense. I don't even know how to describe them, but they're really cute. I'm obsessed with them. Um, I got them in another color. I'm just going to show those before I show anything else. I got in this like yellow beigey color. It looks more yellow on camera than it does in real life, but... The lighting isn't doing it any justice, but it's it's a pretty color. Then I got this top. It's like off the shoulders, brown. It's a cute top. Um, then here's the dress that I said I got that's kind of like the same. It's literally like the same, except this one has straps, so. It looks a lot shorter, but once I have it on, it's cute. Then I got this white, oh, this is not white, this is pink. There's fuzz on it. This pink top, and I already wore this, and I'm not a huge fan of it because the straps always fall down, 
Now, I don't usually have problems with tops like that, but it's still really cute. I'm still gonna wear it. Oh my gosh, I love this. This dress is so cute. It's like a really long dress and then it has like slits on the side. I have these shorts in like a lighter pink and then a black and I wear them all the time. So I got them in neon pink, hot pink, whatever. This shirt is so cute. It's like a flower top. I kind of got one in like a bigger size because, not a bigger size, but like a size up from what I usually get because I wanted to wear like a white tank top under it. I seen some girl wearing it on TikTok like that and I, I wanted to wear it like that. So I got inspired. Then I got these pants. These ones are more like different from the Shein ones. They're more of like a beachy, lighty, lighty? A lighter, flowier kind of pants, which are really cute for the beach. So I got them in that pink color, then this blue color. And then just in black, per. All right, so after Forever 21, I have American Eagle and I got these mom shorts, which like everyone has them, but they're so cute. These ones. These are like low rise and usually I don't wear low rise, but sometimes low rise does look cute. So I got two pairs of low rise ones. These ones are low rise too. Then I have a dark pair. Cute. And then I have this dark pair. Per. I only had, okay, I thought I had only three pairs of shorts that fit me from last summer. But it turns out I'm still the same size, just some of the shorts like fit weird. I don't know how to describe it. I'm either a two or a four, and last year I was only a two. So I still fit into some of them, but some of them I didn't, so I had to give some away. But I actually have like four pairs from last year, so I just had to get, had to re-up my my shorts I don't know if that made sense but whatever all right and then last for clothing I went to H&M and got this top cute um these biker shorts came in a pack and I wanted a black pair but they came with this like green sage color too so I didn't mind because sage green is really cute right now so I could just wear that with whatever, whatever. And then I have just black ones, the ones that came in the pack. Then these shorts are the ones that are like loose everywhere, like a longer pair. And they say easy sole on them somewhere, I think over here. Yeah. And I don't really, I don't really care for the words on it, but I would have liked them better if they were just plain because I didn't even see the letters or the words until after I got it. But then from last, from H&M, I got like a, those flowy pants again because I'm obsessed with them right now. All right, so then next. Um, okay, so next I went to Marshalls and I got this hat because I'm also like going through a stage right now where I like hats, so. A pink Adidas one. And then I got just sandals. I got a white pair with like two little, I just needed a like pair of sandals to wear. I just wanted new ones, just plain ones. Okay, then next I got, from pink, I got this bra. And I needed a strapless one, which is what I went to pink for, but they were having a deal, so I got two. So I just got a nude strapless one. All right, and then last I have the hair stuff. All right, so from Target, I got these hair clips because I'm obsessed with these hair clips. So I got them in like a shinier version, then I got them in like a matte version. They were actually cheap, they were like $3. So, got two. And then at my hair, my hair studio, my hair salon, um, she knows I was going on vacation, so she gave me these little mini cute things and she gave me a, it's by Amika or Amika, I don't know how to say that. It's a really, really good brand. So she gave me this, mm, this smells good, a wave spray. And then she gave me two little hair masks because she said one wouldn't, one wouldn't be enough. So she gave me two. And then last from Marshalls, I got this Foxy Bay leave-in spray in whatever because um, 
Recently, I've been taking really good care of my hair and my friend Allie has this and I used it after the wave pool one day and it actually looks really good, so I suggest this from Marshall. Her. Okay, so that's everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. I'll see you guys in the next video I make because I'm gonna try to make more, more often. So. Bye.